Everyone's standing near me. Nothing over here. This motion blur is ridiculous. Is it even motion blur? It might just be just bad frame rate. Yeah, it's just really bad. Oh. I'll always stay strong, kick ass, love you Lonnie. Okay, well yeah. Oh my god. Katie. I, I fell asleep in the attic. In Lonnie and my old spot, and I missed the first two calls. I just barely caught the third one before the machine got it. And it was Lonnie. On a payphone. She'd been on the bus to basic, and she said she couldn't... She couldn't think of anything but me and us, and that she couldn't go through with it, with the army and being a part and all of it. And so she got off the bus in Salem. She said, Sam, I want you to pack up everything you can and get in your car and come find me. And let's just drive until we find somewhere for us. And she asked me if I could do that. And I said, yes. Yes. Alrighty. Well, it feels like we missed a few of the clues because I know we we saw that Lonnie wore army clothes in that picture and she talked about it early on when she first met her. But I feel like we missed the whole thing with her going to basic and going away. Oh well. Sorry. I tried to run through this as fast as I could while still finding shit. This is yeah, grab. This is all just shit for doing pictures. Let's, let's look at the pictures. Oh, that's pretty cool. That's pretty nifty. You can't take that with an iPhone. Oh wow, that is. That's pretty cool, actually. I'm not gonna lie. I hear you creaking stuff. Stop, I'm gonna turn on the lights. Stay away. I guess that's her uniform. I didn't see anything in the first one. Nothing in here. That's just photo paper. Put it back. More photo paper. Photo paper. Well, uh, I don't think dead Lonnie's up here. I think it's just her hangout area. Damn it, Thunder. Uh, what's over here? Oh, this looks like the end of the road right here. Shit. No one pop out of those chairs. No one do that. Don't do that to me. Read letters to Katie. Shit, is that the end? Katie, oh my I'm God. so sorry that I can't be there to see you in person, that I can't tell you all this myself, but I hope as you read this journal and you think back that you'll understand why I had to do what I did and that you won't be sad and you won't hate me and you'll just know that I am where I need to be. I love you so much, Katie. I'll see you again someday. Love, Sam. Dang. So that's the end of right there. Yep, it appears so. So the parents are gone. I might have missed a few clues along the way because that's just what I do. I'm not a thorough investigator, uh, but maybe they were out looking for Sam, or they were just gone. No, she said the parents won't be here, so I guess they were on a vacation, or they were just gone somewhere. And Sam just saw that was her move to go. That was a really good game. That was entertaining. I was creeped out most of the time, and I knew beforehand that I wasn't, it wasn't a horror-type movie. The, the sounds in there were great. I'm going to turn this down a little bit. That was, that was pretty good, not gonna lie. 
I'm not much of a guy for like those point and click kind of mystery games, but you know, it's worth a try. So, uh, if you like this video, if you like this game, if you like my voice, if you if you think if you're just indifferent on anything, don't forget to comment, whatever your heart desires, and like this video, and heck, subscribe to us if you're really cool. Uh, this is Ben from Summer Discomfort. Signing off. Stay discomfort.